is move this uh, this blue icon around, which is represented by the chopper spotlight. When the player is within this bound, I'm going to gain points up there. All these points can be used to activate apps like this. And when I activate an app, it will take a little bit of time before it gets activated. When the player is going to go near there, when he's doing the race, he's going to, act to trigger it by proximity. And now we're going to see it, and bam, he just slammed into it. The second thing you need to do is use these slots up there to drag and drop with your resources, different cup cars. And when these guys are spawned, they're going to go and act like uh, any, any cups that you see in the game. And they're going to be working with me towards stopping the player. And now we can see that there's a big crash and pursuit happening there while the player, which is a red guy, tries to, to move away. The idea is that there's a larger circle around it that is revealing parts of the map and that decides where I can activate or not different items. So I need to keep the spotlight at all times. You see the eye rolling up there. It gives me points. These points can be used to be spent on the... Uh, I can yeah, I can spend the points on resources to do something. Now you're stuck. Okay, so he's dead. Now I have one. The idea is that uh, I didn't win the race right now. Oh, hey, what? Did it stop it? Did you quit it? Did you quit it? Oh. Okay, it's fine. I'll send a new game. Usually you should have been able to uh, retry it. You've already ran out of time. So, okay, okay, you, you ran out of time. So that's the thing. Um, the racing player will lose when he runs out of time. But if he's dead, he's going to try again. He's going to have a chance to try again to play it. Um, and he wins, and the racing player wins if you reach the end. So, except the new one, it's going to be a different one. You're going to be able to do it. I thought you died at the beginning. I was like, oh, he's dead. He should have a retry. So yeah, when you die, you resume the race back to the beginning. Uh, not the beginning, the, at your last checkpoint. Sorry about that. Okay, right. so this is a new race. Again, I see the opponent. My chopper was spawned. I will have my little light that I can move around and keep it always centered on the player. Now we can see that he's going to hit the traffic light, so I'll activate that. Make sure he has a little bit of challenge along the way while he's getting stuck left and right. And I'll start spawning a few cut cars. The, the number of points I spend on the cut car uh, will, actually, um, will actually determine the strength. Can you, uh, yes. can you attach the light to, I mean, can you attach to the car and have it go automatically follow you? No, no, you no, have, you always you have, have yeah, yeah, you okay. always have to control it. You see, as long as I uh, keep my, uh, the, 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 the pinpoint circle, you know, the mm -hmm. middle of the circle, yep. on the car, it'll activate, uh, it'll activate the, cho the chopper sniper. You see him activating once in a while, you know, when I keep going like this. Yep. So if I keep doing this, you're gonna get, uh, at one point you're gonna, be able to activate the sniper and he's going to shoot and that could break a tire, it could break the uh, the windshield, it damages the car in the end, making it uh, easier to explode. So I'll start activating a few things, activate those. The idea is to always be able to guess which path the player is going to take. So now he's pretty much stuck at this bridge, he's going to go in the water. Almost went in the water, now he's stuck, and that makes him spend time. So I put the sniper back on him, try to stop him right now. The cops are having his way with him, and I should be winning in about 10 seconds. And that's it. We have won. Yes, victory. In the last, the last match, Gateway Getaway. Uh, this one is called. Uh, this one is a uh, is a free run. It's a free race. So the idea is that um, there's not going to be any GPS like you've seen. Uh, if you accept that contract right now, okay. so uh, this one doesn't have the GPS being uh, uh, activated by default. So instead of being like a race where the uh, the player, the racing player, sees the GPS, this one actually only has a goal 
and you can't take any back to get there. So uh, it's, that's what we call it, free mode. I'm pretty sure it's called free mode. Okay, right, so you see on the on the minimap right there, it doesn't have like the GPS right away. So this one really becomes like more of a guessing game because I need to know how to, uh, I need to try to guess which way he's going to take. Try that, maybe. See right now I can't activate anything because I didn't add any points. So. Uh, this app is going to be working for Android and iOS. Yes, uh, we should ask uh, Phil, Phil is right there. Yep. He's the lead designer on it. I'm pretty sure it's uh, iOS and Android. Uh, I just can't. I just can't confirm anything because I don't want to lie to anybody. But, uh, oh, you see. So now he's on foot, as you can see. Now I'm using the sniper on him. It's going to be super effective to drain his life. Now he stole another car, and he's going to go afterward. So I can truly expect him to go there, so now I'll, I'll activate this one in advance. He went the complete other way. The same rule still applies that uh, he has a certain amount of time and he needs to reach the position, uh, these points, the yellow objective icon, within a certain amount of time. Okay, so we don't have any cars left. As you can see, when I spawn a car, I can't drop it too close to the player. I need to select like something that's quite far away or else it wouldn't be fair. So we'll try to drop everything we have. Try to go back on course here. When you're playing this app, does it need to be uh, inside the same network as the? No, no, no. Okay. You can you, you play it on the internet, and you have uh, okay. you have a few uh, a few options to connect. Uh, I think you can connect to UPlay, PSN, and the uh, and the Xbox. I think. Should ask again. Should ask Phil okay. to make sure like uh, what the usernames are supported. Yeah. I don't remember all the uh, all the details, the specific details about it. But it's it's definitely on the internet, so you could be in the metro and play it and with other people that you know or random people on the street. So you see right now, I'm like filled up on my uh, my different uh, different things. I'm performing really well, and that's it. Player has been killed. We're gonna wait for the respawn because he has uh, as long as he has time left. He's, he can still resume the race. So he still has 30 seconds to reach the other one. And all my calls are being resumed also. She's gonna get them after him. 
That's it. And there we go.